Welcome back fellow techies to our latest tutorial video. I am the Technician Project and today's tutorial is going to show you how to do some keyboard shortcuts in GarageBand. Now we're going to start off our project today in GarageBand and the first couple of shortcuts we're going to use are the new project and new track shortcuts. So to create a new project we're going to press Command N. So that's Command N. And this will create a new project. So we're just going to save our existing project. And um, we'll just create an audio project. It's a basic project, as you can see, going through the steps there. And we're going to create a new track. So we want to create a new track. It's Command Option N. And that will ask you to create a new track. Select between any track you want to select. So we're just going to go back quickly to our first project. Go back to the original project. Here we go. And the next shortcut we're going to show you is zooming. So we're going to zoom in by pressing Command Right. And we're going to zoom back out by pressing command left. So zoom in and zoom out. The next shortcut is automation. Dead easy. You press A on your keyboard. The next one is split region at playhead. So you have to highlight your region and press command T. So let's highlight your region, press Command T. Highlight your region, click where you want to do, press Command T. And you can see we've got three cuts there. Now, if you highlight your regions and press Command J, it will rejoin the regions together. And say you've done a cut originally and do Command J, and it's two separate tracks, it will bounce the region out for you and create the fade in the middle if needs be. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more. And also ding dong that notification bell to get further updates. Thanks again. Goodbye.